Gomitas velitas. Let's taste this. So we're going to do our tasting inside and my friend Ben has kindly agreed to join me. Gomitas velitas are gummy candles and they're made by Tolteca in Fresno, California. Fresno? That's 200 miles from San Francisco. Did you know that in Spanish, Fresno means ash tree? And that ash is considered one of the best burning firewoods. Oh, I see the theme you're going for. <laughs> um, I didn't know that. I knew that the IRS is in Fresno. Um, anyway, so the, the packaging says, Ponle sabor a tu vida. And that means spice up your life. And I only took one semester of Spanish about 20 years ago, so I had to look that up, um, what that meant. And when I typed it in to search, the first result that came up was a My Little Pony episode with that name, and it was in Spanish. And I watched the whole thing, the whole episode. And from what I gathered, I think the episode was about the challenges of being in the restaurant industry. Um, and it was also, I think, about the importance of friendship. Hmm. I imagine trying gummy candles out together can really try or test a friendship. You know, it could snuff out any flames. That's another good one, Ben. Um, so I went to the corner store, which is about a block from here, and it's called Oxbridge Market, and they got these. Um, they're $1.69 for the package, and they're 12 candles, so it's about 15 cents per candle. And the thing that stood out for me when I saw them is that they look a lot like real candles, like the size, they look like they might be made of wax. And that's kind of off-putting to me to think that I might be biting into a stick of wax. Uh, what do you think? I totally agree. Um, I never expect gummy bears to taste like bears. I don't expect gummy snakes to taste like snakes. But gummy candles and the way they look, I think you have a strong point. Like Sour Patch Kids, those are gummy human children. But nobody seems to be rooted out by that like because they don't actually look like real human children, like evenly covered in sugar and like, you know, children can be covered in sugar a little bit, but usually they're just not like uniformly distributed on, on a child. Gummy candies are only an inch tall and I don't think I've ever seen any kids that are an inch tall. That, that's another good point. Uh, so, so, yeah, these just are unique because they're gummy candies, but they look like real candles to me. So it makes me want to try them. So some these orange one for you. So it looks like there's some kind of plastic. I'm going to try to squeeze it out. Should I just try biting into it? I think so. Okay, we'll Cheers. use our, our two different methods and see what happens. Good luck. Yeah, I can't just bite into it. I can't squeeze it out either. How do you, I, maybe if you bite it, it'll squeeze out. It kind of reminds me of those mango jellies that you get at the Asian supermarkets. Mm. I think they eventually became a choking hazard and they... Or maybe that's just the lychee ones, but... Um, I, think, I think mango is the right flavor. I think it's... It it's, could be mango. I'm not... Yeah, well, it's it's hard orange. to tell, like... It's definitely like sugary and sweet. Mm -hmm. Kind of challenge you to eat. Jello, then a gummy. Like well, a really it's not thick like jello. a thick jello, yeah. But it's not like a gummy bear. It's not like that mm -hmm. texture. It's really really different from anything I've ever tried before. It's absolutely not what I yeah could it's have not imagined. yeah it's not what I ex thought it would be. I thought it would be a lot um, softer mm -hmm. and easier to eat. <laughs> this would be good cut up in really small pieces and in boba. I'm glad we tried this because it's really different from anything I've ever tried before. So I'm not really a fan of how it's packaged. The texture was okay. Like I'm, I'm really glad it wasn't like biting into wax. I wasn't disgusted. I wasn't blown away. So all in all, I give it, I give it a thumbs up. I give it. A middle of the road, I think, just because 
Yeah, I wasn't blown away. I wasn't disgusted. I don't think I would buy them again. So, but I don't think I wouldn't tell people they were disgusting or anything.、Mm. So, middle of the road. Great. Well, thanks for watching. Let's taste this.